Hey everyone, it's Mr. Matt Freak, and welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider The Last Revelation. Hey guys, um, how you doing? Sorry it's taking me so long to upload another one of these. I got really sick, and I came down with a flu, and I'm sorry, I just got really sick, so I couldn't upload it for a while. But I'm now back in business, and we can do this again, so let's do it. Right. Okay, so when we last left off, um, Lara and Verna von Croy were racing to the treasure in this temple. Which, I don't think we know what it's called yet, I don't even think we find out what it's called in this game. But it's called the Iris. And... The game doesn't really explain what exactly the iris is. It, I don't know. It's hard to explain. It looks like... I, I can't even explain it. You're just going to have to see it yourselves. But I'll show it to you when we get there. But yeah, but that's the main... That was the main goal in this. To get to the iris. Which I, oh, shit. Okay, I better not die. Which, I don't know, I didn't really get. It's later explained, though, the Iris in Tomb Raider Chronicles. Which, we'll get to that. Later. <laughs> A long time later, but later. Alright, so how's everyone doing? Have you guys all been? Are you so excited for October? I know I am. I'm really excited for Halloween. I'm so excited for the holidays. I can't wait. Um, I don't know what I'm going to be yet, though. I have to figure that out. Okay. Now this part's going to take a little bit of time, because I have really no idea where to go. These dark parts really trip me up. Um, okay. Because seriously... I cannot see that much in this. Oh, <gasps> oh my God. That is like the first time I ever did that perfectly. Cool, we're here, we did it. <laughs> I am not such an old man after all, yeah? Come here, child. The mechanism will require us both to release it. The plinth inscription warns of vengeance on those who remove it. Ah, ancient hocus pocus. Forget this nonsense and come over here. I don't count poison darts and triggered entombment, your average child's tea party. I feel we should lend this some respect. Ah, and you are the world famous archaeologist adventurer Lara Croft, yeah? No, no, I am the adventurer, Werner von Croy, and you will do as I say. Go to the wall and pull the lever. What was it you said? Disrespect is the route to carelessness? I am weary of this. Pull the lever now, Miss Croft. On your head be it, von Croy. Have faith in experience, child, and you will learn more than simple...
Okay, I'm sorry um, that I like just stopped talking a lot just right there. It's just um, there's one thing I like to do, and then I'm gonna get it gonna do in these LPs. I'm just gonna not talk through cutscenes because I feel like they're the important part. They are the story, and uh, I don't really like it. Um, I don't know. I just don't like talking over them because I feel like maybe it's ruining them a little bit. So I just like to leave them like that. Alright, and with that, we begin the actual game. Yay! It's taken us like a month, but we're finally at the tutorial level. Yay! Ow, I just hit my teeth. Oh my god. I just hit the, I don't know. Okay. Yes! Finally have the tutorial level. Alright, awesome. Okay. I literally love this game. Um, I used to not really um, like it that much because I was like, oh, it's all about Egypt. But, you know, I kind of like it now because I like that it's all in Egypt. It's just all ex her exploring all these different parts of Egypt, like Cairo and Alexandria. And then actual tombs and ruins like this. Speaking of tombs and ruins, but why are we here? Like, what happened with Von Croy? Why is Lara older now? Who's this guy with a torch? And what are we doing here? Why do we have a longer ponytail? Look at that. It's longer than two meter three and Whoa, why the heck? Our boobs. I don't know if you can see them. Look at our boobs. They're huge. Seriously? She like, I don't know. I, I, I say they're natural. You know what? I say they're natural. I'm just going to put it out there. I think they're natural. But a lot of people disagree. And say that she had, you know, the surgery. And, but, uh, you know, I don't know. I think they're natural. Okay. And here we have a large metal pack and a scorpion. Okay, we killed it. Now, some scorpions in this game, there are black ones and then there are red ones. The black ones can only damage you, but the red ones can actually damage you and poison you at the same time. Kind of sucks. All right. Let's continue down here. Like that one. I were here right now because there's really. I don't know. Just keep going. Oh, cutscene. Now, these ones, when it's just showing an area, I will talk over because it's like it's not that much. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, he's walking and we're just standing there. <gasps> oh my god, look at this. A dog? What the fuck is Oh no, there's a dog! Oh my gosh. There's zombie dogs everywhere. This is Resident Evil. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, yeah. In this game, since it's all about Egypt, there is no cats that attack you, but we do have Egyptian dogs that will attack you. And like, you know, the, the ones, they look like they're statues the dogs and then they just come alive. It's really weird. That really didn't make that much sense, but okay. And now we're in this big room. And what are we gonna do? Because we what are you gonna do, mister? Oh my god, he's playing. What the fuck is that? How should we start? Oh! Red Scorpion! Other Scorpion! Scary! Okay. He opened the door for us somewhere. Oh, right here. Now, if we go down here, I believe there is one secret. Down here. Yeah. It's right here. First secret. And it's just some shotgun shells. 
Two good scorpions. Gosh, there's a lot in this particular level. Alright. One secret down. I don't know how many more to go. Ooh, and it looks like I made it back. Yay! Alright. Now we gotta go back up there and meet Mr. Tour Guide. And there's actually something we have to do. Because, oh, I'll better show you here. Okay, so see those platforms over there? That one. Oh, I know. In this game, we get binoculars for the first time, so cool. See that thing over there? And this thing? Well, it's just a medipack. We need to get to those things. Especially the golden. I don't know what kind. I don't know what it is, so I can't. I don't know. It's some Egyptian thing. But we need to get to that. How can we, though? Well, up here, there's like in the walls, there are these squared holes that Lara puts her hand through. I know, kind of weird, huh? But she puts her hand through them, like this one, and one of them releases a bunch of sand. <gasps> there you go. And see, now, once the sand fills up, we can get over there. And some of these holes actually contain items. Like this one, I think, contains a meta pack. <gasps> Large one, cool. And over here. There's some flares. I know there are flares here. Where are they? Oh, there we go. And I'm going to use a lot of flares in this game. Seriously. <sighs> really? Alright. Because seriously, this game is so dark you sometimes can't see anything. Okay. Now we got to go down and get our prize, which is the meta pack and the key item, which is this Egyptian... I think. Oh, I'm almost about 15 minutes. So guys, this concludes another part. Another part. I can't say that right. Uh, to the last revelation. See you next time, guys.